Hi guys, Diane here. And I actually wanted to talk to you guys a little bit today about operating excellence, right? So how well are you doing against your competition? And the reason I wanna talk about this today is because I was actually recently at a business owners networking event where you know I came upon a group that was actually talking about operational excellence. And it always strikes me as a little bit odd when you see a lot of small business owners talking about operational excellence, because this is usually a topic that's reserved for larger, more mature corporations, you know, companies that are interested in, you know, improving their processes, focused on BPM, the people who are thinking about going lean, providing more agile um, approaches within their business. And so when I hear small business owners talking about it, it always kind of catches my interest. And I definitely want to know, like, what is their definition of operating excellence? Are we talking about the same thing? So what exactly is operational excellence? Well, operating excellence at its most basic form comes down to execution. It's about executing consistently and reliably over a long period of time. That long period of time, guys, is what is crucial. This is not a, hey, we'll do this for one month, we'll do this for a, you know, a week, we'll do it for a few days, and then we'll slip back into our old habits. It's about being able to consistently execute at a high level over a long period of time. So what does this really mean for small business owners, right? Like, so I mentioned, it does strike me as a little bit of uh, odd when I hear small business owners talking about it, because it is something that you see more larger corporations who are really trying to improve their existing infrastructure. But for small business owners, um, execution and consistent execution is incredibly important because this is what you see is lacking in a lot of small businesses. When we talk about, you know, whether or not you are able to outpace your competitors as a small business owner, it really comes down to one of the core tenets of operational excellence, and that is the execution piece. Are you executing your business plan, your strategy, your operations at a consistent high level over the long term, right? So when you don't have consistency in your execution, this is where you fall behind with your competitors. And this is what we're talking about when it comes to operational excellence. So as a small business owner, it is something that's crucial and it's at its most basic form. Are you executing consistently at a high level, right? So, so would you outpace your competitors if you had the same strategies? That becomes the major question um, that a lot of people are asking. You know, there are a lot of businesses that do the same thing. There are a lot of, um, you know, coaches, there are a lot of consultants, there are a lot of online businesses. But if you had the same strategies, and a lot of small businesses do, would you be able to outpace your competitors? And this usually comes down to consistency in your marketing execution. It comes down to consistency in your client experience. What is your sales process? Is that consistent? If not, then you might not be operating to your full potential. And this is likely where you're going to fall behind your competitors, right? So how do you implement this within a small business? It really comes down to just a couple really core tenets, right? Number one, what is your strategy? Are you clear on what you're trying to do in your business? And does everyone in the business who is supporting it know what this strategy is as well, right? So it's, your tech person or your VA or you know your business partner all have to be on the same page if you're going to consistently execute at a high level. So it really comes down to getting clear on your strategy and making sure that it is properly disseminated in your team. The number two thing that you need when you are trying to you know consistently um, execute over the long haul is do you have the right team to support you? This is also a big step where a lot of small business owners go wrong because they think, oh, when I get to a certain revenue number or when I get to a some, certain number of customers, then I'll be able to bring on the team. And when you delay bringing on the team, that's where you start to fall behind. That's where you start to drop the balls in certain areas of your business. And this is what leads to the lack of consistency and the lack of ability to execute. Trust me, I tried to do it myself. It is impossible to do it all alone. So if you want to operate at a consistently high level so that you can outpace your competitors, you have to have the team to support that endeavor. You cannot do it alone. And that's something that you really need to, to um to take to heart if you are a small business owner and you really want to be able to differentiate yourself through the rest of the competition. 
So those are really the two main pieces that at a small business level are really what are going to be able to push you into an area of operational excellence. As you become larger, there are some more complex pieces around, you know, business process mapping, you know, operational effectiveness, agile approaches, things along those lines. But for the most part, you don't have to worry about that as a small business owner. It's all about making sure that you have a clear strategy, making sure that your team knows about what the strategy is so they can properly support the business and making sure that you do have a team around the business, supporting the day-to-day operations of the business so you can consistently hit those um, your messaging and that you can consistently execute at a really high level, right? So where does your business fall within the scale of operating excellence? Do you think you would outpace your competitors with your, you know, who have similar strategies to you? Drop me a comment below and let me know, or feel free to reach out if you have questions and you want to chat further about, you know, bring operational excellence to your own company. All right. I love chatting with you guys and I love hearing from you. So feel free to definitely reach out. And until next time, this is Diane. Thanks. Bye guys.